Welcome to the update, pal. Arrow Academy has just announced Survivor Ballads, the three films by Shohei Imamura on Blu-ray. This three-film box set looks exquisite and includes three of his greatest films. Here's a little bit about the box. Throughout the 1980s, Shohei Imamura, the pornographers and profound desires of the gods, a leading figure of the Japanese New Wave era of the 1960s, cemented his international reputation as one of the most important directors of his generation with a series of films that all competed at cons to great critical acclaim. This exclusive box set from Arrow Academy presents restored versions of three late career classics from the legendary filmmaker. It is available now for pre-order, and here is a little bit more about the films. Based on an ancient folktale, The Ballad of Nariyama from 1983 was the first of two works from the director to win the prestigious Khan Palme d'Or. Imamura's magnum opus depicts the members of an extended farming family eking out their existence in the mountainous north of Japan against the backdrop of the changing seasons before village lore decrees they make the sacrifice of abandoning their aged mother on the top of a nearby mountain when she reaches her 70th year. Making its HD debut, Zagan 1987 takes a satirical look at Japan's pre-war colonial expansion through the unscrupulous eyes of its flesh peddler anti-hero as he establishes a prostitution enterprise across Southeast Asia. Finally, the harrowing Black Rain 1989 details the precarious existence of a household of atomic bomb survivors as, five years after being caught in the blast of Hiroshima, they struggle to find a husband for their 25-year-old niece. Honestly, these sound like hard, torturous dramas, to be completely honest. I am not familiar with these films. I know Imamura, but I don't know these films. I know The Ballad of Narayama is on Criterion Blu-ray, and I have considered getting it, but uh, now that it's on this set, I may just grab all three in one swoop. These three works epitomize the director's almost documentary style of filmmaking, exposing the vulgar yet vibrant and instinctive underbelly of Japanese society through a sympathetic focus on peasants, prostitutes, criminal lowlife, and other marginalized figures to explore the schism between the country's timeless pre-modern traditions and the modern face it projects to the world. Limited edition contents, of course, include restored high-definition Blu-rays of all three films, uh, Lhasa's Japanese PCM mono soundtracks, optional English subtitles, of course, those will not be optional for most of us, brand new audio commentaries on all three films by Japanese cinema expert Jasper Sharp, brand new in-depth appreciation of all three films by Tony Raines, alternate color ending to Black Rain, shot by Imamura, but removed from the film shortly before its release, that's interesting. Archival interviews on Black Rain with actress Yoshiko Tanaka. And, oh wow, assistant director Takeshi Miike. No shit. That's awesome. Take and for those of you who don't know, Takeshi Miike is one of the most prolific Japanese filmmakers out there. And he's still working, making amazing movies. Uh, the original Japanese press kit for Ballad of Narayama and Black Rain. That's going to be on uh, BD-ROM. Limited edition 60-page booklet containing new writing by Tom Mez. And, uh, of course, limited edition packaging featuring original and newly commissioned artwork by Tony Stella. Well, there you have it, Survivor Balance, the three films by Shohei Imamura. Thank you so much, Arrow Academy. I do think that I will be adding these to my collection. If you guys are going to be adding it to your collection, please let me know in the comments below. I'm curious. And if you've seen any of these, please leave your reviews below. No spoilers, of course. I'd uh, love to get your impressions on these three films by Shohei Imamura. This sounds like a, a beautiful collection, gorgeous box set there, and uh, I think this belongs on my shelf. And if you don't have it and it uh, tickles your fancy, then it definitely belongs on yours. Well, that'll do for today. Until we meet again, I hope this video finds you well. I'll see you next time, but until then, this is your friendly neighborhood, Master Chaos, signing off. Take care.